Uh, we're going uh, to Oak Wood and all today. Uh, this place is labelled as a Fahan Valley Woodland. And this wee car park under the right seems to be the main car park. So if you're coming down the main new main A6 road, you'll turn off at the roundabout. It goes to Eglinton Airport, City Day Airport. And it brings you up this wee road. This is a new road they made. This road didn't exist before until you get to this bridge. Once you go way up there, that road existed. But you used to access that from Brentola Bridge ahead. So it used to just come up, come up the ways and straight on. So every was straight on. Every was less than a mile from here. Oak Fire is across this bridge here. They built a new car park. So oh, what am I doing now? This car just stop start. Oh, she's very quiet. We wrote this like, but uh, so uh, the oaks there. This bridge only goes to two houses, three houses. But uh, they used to keep the machines in here on the left hand side. They're now making us a car park. They had a banner up there last week saying the car park wasn't finished. Banner's away now. But um, they have a proper car park. Uh, uh, if you go into these woods, there's car parks all over and laybys all over it. But this is um, the only car park. It's sort of signposted from the main road. So anybody going from London to Belfast, Belfast to London Day, this is the only car park that's really signposted. Uh, so where are they ever going to put tarmac on it? doesn't look like they are. Um, the Woodland Trust have got their own car park on the far side of the river, we'll see it later. It has proper tarmac, wheelie bin, and um, look, I can't wait to get out. But this is handy here, you can bring a caravan, motorhome, anything in here. So why the Woodland Trust put a height barrier on theirs, but it's up a very narrow road. It wouldn't be a, the road doesn't go anywhere. I don't know why they put it where they did. Huh? But um, but now we'll get you unhooked. So I'll just tape the main points of this. Now I come to this wood quite often, but uh, it opened officially last Wednesday, first of August, I think it was. Last Wednesday. So that's the official opening. Uh, they had volunteers and all here. I wouldn't come when there's volunteers here. You know why you come when the way a pub and you got volunteers and bubbles on them? You know, dogs, you don't need. The best comments are a wee bit of rain and all the volunteers are all been out the night before and they're drunk and all and hangovers. So, uh, they put a new sculpture and all here. A lot of sculptures and all. Where are you coming for the sculptures? Uh, the nice little lottery funded a lot of this. So what they're done here now is um, oak wood is just over this hole, down this hole. There's your main road. You will turn up that main road now, but call it right down below. You come up that hole, you have to turn off left on the roundabout. Cross, uh, go underneath the main road. There's a bridge underneath the main road, and then come up a road the far side, and then across it. It's a long way. We're driving right through all the trees. But there's no straight way to it, any of them. Uh, we count is here. So make sure you get counted. You know, if, if enough of people come, they might put a wee bit of tarmac in there. You know what, but too many people come, they put a high fire on and it's time to spray the machine. I think best not get counted. Uh, that's one of the wee lakes there now. A wee ball rushes on it, look at that boy. So all the rainwater now from this road goes into these wee lakes, the whole pile of them, the whole length of the road. I think the idea of the wee lakes slows the water down, so the water just doesn't run straight to the river. And if you've got a big flood, they overflow and will go to the river. But uh, if you've got normal rain, they'll probably just soak into the ground naturally. But I love the seaweed bull rushes. I never thought of a seaweed bull rushes out here. All these canals and stuff like that. They no real need to build this wee footpath. That road's quiet. And you have to go on that wee road for those last 20 feet. So I don't know why they built the footpath. And the road's actually easier. If you're in a wheelchair or something, not that you'd be going to this wood in a wheelchair. Wouldn't be suitable for that. But the road would be easier. Uh, as it is now, it's August 2023. Right there, boy, look. Oh, this drainage scheme here, boss. Um, None of these wee lakes are locked. You see, see if you had a wee motor home now. You could open that wee gate. Look at that there. Not be a nice wee, not be a nice wee spot there to camp at night time, wouldn't it? Eh? That's just for maintenance vehicles. Something there, look at the wee bull rushes. Oh look, they put barriers up. 
They weren't always up there, but they didn't put on padlocks. That wasn't up there last week. It has to happen you get a fresh look now. They'll probably have to find out now if they put a padlock who's going to hold the key. Ah, uh, they put a lot of fencing up that wasn't up before. Everything's fenced off now. Look at that! That's the oak spire just over there. It looks good, you know. I've seen a boy going down the zip line. And I'm proud of him. It does look good. But you like a wee sign opening times and prices. You have to book as a group as far as I can see. You just can't pull over in your car and go on and pay for an hour. Ah, uh, they're putting railings up here. But I'll tell you what's interesting here with these railings. How do we look at them? They're building them the traditional way. Almost. That's how railings go in there. Put the big wall up here. Uh, you put the wee bits of metal in. They welded that on. I'm sure traditionally they wouldn't have done it that way. They dry stone walls, wouldn't they? The railings are made as original as they can do. These wee boys here are on uh, flattened. They drilled the hole straight and they flattened the metal there. Them is not welded. So that's the way they would have done it years ago. Don't know if that camera's showing it up. By the time they get the wee wall in there, you won't see all this crap. But there's a wee bit of weld on the top. Uh, don't like the pillars here. But the entrance to this house was in the bottom of this hill. And I think that's similar to the rooms they had originally. So what they've made is replicas. So I'll tell you what, anybody who's lost a bit of land, most of them seem to have done well out of it, don't they? And like there's wee rubbits and things in here. I'm not quite sure how they cast that. But that's all cast there, that's not your cheap iron thin metal. Then I'm on this way. Uh, so I don't know what the boys are for holidays now, why they're not finishing that off there. That's quite after a period. Why hard to cycle this too like? Uh, you're not allowed to cycle in these woods. This here I thought it was a bit expensive. That is real oak there. Now, there's a sculpture to be seen for the main road. A lot of money spent in out in this place. There's six iron girders holding that beast up. There was a good big uh, lump of concrete in the bottom. And I thought when I seen the concrete, they might be putting one of them electronic signs. You know, the ones that tells you, for bridges closed, it lights up. Don't drink and drive. I thought, oh, it's about too far away from the road for that. It's a sculpture. And um, it's a sort of big tree. They cut it in two for some reason. I can't, a lawyer could carry that in one piece. I would say it must be something to do with craning and iron. So the middle of that tree must be hollow. And uh, they've slotted them over. But it is solid, like it's not an old, it's not an old tree that's rotted and fell down. See, it's solid, that, that thing there. And preserved and something. So, if you're looking for the entrance to oak wood, come up the main road and see that. Take your next left off. Must I bring you here? So a few bits of water piping all lying around here, yes. Still a wee bit of tidying up needs done. But uh, it's handy about a lot of these places. See where they've got double fences. It's handy if you've got a dog. You can let them off. they are not going to get on the main road. Even my wee mutt there, who gets on the fences and stuff, she can't get onto that. She's never tried. And when all these trees are growing, there's some job. Um, you can walk 10 miles here. That's a whole limit of walks here now. Um, there's probably too many walks, it's too too far. Like I could walk from here now to the end of Nest Wood. It's a bit far, but you could do it. And uh, I'm going to follow the wee signs today. I hope these cars here aren't volunteers. See, it's a bit annoying when people come go for a walk and then they park right up at the entrance, isn't it? There's two cars there now, but you know I used to be car parks too far to walk, but they're going for a walk. Then we cones went there last week either. I hope there's nobody here that had bubbles on them. That's where you spoil my day, that. So that big sign is there. That's the original entrance for this bike house down here at Oak House. 
I'll take it to all coast. It's an awkward. Maybe there's a different name. But the house itself is down there. The house is empty. And the boys are using it the grounds for um, adventure pits. So this oak wood would have been their garden and the lane would have went out there. It's got a really big zipline so it has. Anybody wants to do a zipline, I say you have to go a long way to get a zipline as big as that. It's long. A couple of shorter ziplines as well. I think it is up line myself, so we're trying to organize a group. Everybody's always busy, isn't it? Half different days and stuff. So all these wee signs here just got in this last couple of weeks. I've been busy this last couple of weeks. Oh well, there you are now. Welcome Woodland Trust, Northern Ireland. There's another one in the counties. That's an older one there. Um Oak Woods Car Park. Brackfield Wood. So Brackfield Wood is at the other side of the river. What is there's nothing saying you tell you oak wood, is there? There's oak wood in front of us. So this is oak woods here now, we sign. Well I couldn't see nothing, I could look at the last day. Sculpture, oh look it does tell you. So the sculpture loop is 6.6 .6 kilometers, 4.1 miles, and the valley trail is 5.2. We'll do the sculpture today because people are interested in art. Sculpture one is the blue. So probably the wee blue signs today. And Valley Trail. See this is not showing you the whole thing. This is only showing you oak wood. You have to cross the river and all to get to the other ones. Uh, there's all sorts of wildlife in here. There's all sorts of green in here. It's all here. Information points. It's all here. Uh, that wee wood is separate. That's all young trees. I wasn't sure if that was private the last time I was here. I went on down by the house and up that lane there, you see. So you could drive right round there. Heritage farm. So anybody gambles, can I get help paying for this place here? So we're after the blue ones. We're after the sculptures, Luda. We're going for sculptures today. So this wee path, this was here. Wee waterfall. Waterfall looks a bit dodgy like. It's going to be a lot of soil erosion. They could be doing a wee bit of work out of it. Then that's why you there now the road ahead. Look both ways. Uh, oak wood runs through on it. Once you're in this wee hole, it's very easy to walk. It's all flat. Uh, an elderly person, I wouldn't recommend coming down this path. The wee path I normally go up Brentola Bridge would be the best car park and you can walk with past it today. And you, that wee path up there boys. I can't say we've been up there. Luna! Okay, we're doing the trail. That's alright, we're doing the trail. We'll do it next time. Can't go anywhere, there's a fence up there. It must be the top of the waterfall. We're doing the wee trail today as all the day visitors are going to do. You see there's a very rotten post there. There has been a fence here before. Can you enjoy your visit? There's a wee barcode. Anybody wants to uh, a wee call them things? You can scan that wee thing there now. Get all the information you need. It's like we look at the waterfall Luna. So anybody coming here is going up at the wee waterfall. But there's a... Uh, Luna! No, no. oh, there's quite a bit of soil rose in here. You see how the everything is man made to help control the water. It's still a white trunk, that you pass by too. If you do a put a couple more big boulders in there, but the water's coming over and taking it away. But that ain't just happened here, and I don't know how recent this is. That concrete there looks pretty old, it's all green with algae and moss. But um That's the original course the stream came down. That water's coming out of the ground from a pipe. So the original stream has been piped up and brought here. But um look how wide this was originally like. 
And then I think I just took a pipe on. So this is going this is going up as wide as that. Can you tell by the amount of water flow? That big lump of concrete there. Walls up there. And all the ground. All the clay. That water splashes now. There's one from the clay behind it. Away. And then the concrete's dropping off. So that also ended up breaking off. And that keep, I keep them back and back until you end up with a valley like that. So they didn't sort that out there, like. It's just a uh, pure clay banking. The tires of water splashing. Is that about the edge where you get down? Well, you see, if you come to the wood and you have to do a wee pee, this is from the end, like. There's an ideal wee spot for a pee here, like. Not many folk up here. Ah, uh, that's part of the Oak Fire Adventure. So that wee path we seen at the start, I don't know where it went there, that's the Oak Fire Adventure boys. They're walking up here and going back that way. Oh, that's right now, Luna. I can either couldn't go anywhere. Oh, that there, boys. And that looked like a wee butt, like a long part there, doesn't it? Hey, romantic. See, they need to put up the wee stones here now, stop the story rolls in here. That water's coming over and taking us away. That's a nicely made wee job there, sort of. Do not belong to what they collapse in here, look. See where it's hot. That water's actually going underneath us. It's tough. Some days it's going to go. That's global warming there, like. Pipe it upstream, it doesn't help either. Back on the trail now. Go on to the sculptures. Now, if I normally came down here, I like these steps here. This fence wasn't up here a couple of weeks ago. Has it been busy? So it's a wee bit muckier than usual because of building this fence. Four mile walk. If I normally do a half a do a mile, half an hour. What's in a two hour video this here, boy? That's about to be two. So once you actually, this is the main path here now. Elderly people and all could do this. You can do this on a wheelchair. So anybody in a wheelchair wants to do any of these woods, oak woods the one to come to. But don't go to that car park. Go to the next car park and I'll show you. So they're sending us Brackfield Woods that way, but they're sending us this way. That's the way I'd normally walk. So we'll go this way. There's plenty of sculptures down here, but they spend some money, I tell you. Some lovely things. You're looking for your garden, like. How do you follow now? How can I tape that now and put these two where we follow that? That's what you get there, you see. That's what you get. This is wee uh, acorns. Wee table and chairs. Lena! Lena! Come on! Lead! Lena! That's some job there, boy. Lena! Come on! Hey, put you on the lead of me, man. Aye. That'd be pop. That'd be pop. Good, doesn't mind be annoyed. Ah, new signs up here now, Pep. Ah. How are you doing? Right, ah. Ah, over here we've got the reindeers. There's no wee sign here for reindeers, boys. Those are sculptures, but you see what you're missing. So here's your reindeers here. I love them. Oh, oh. hold on, no, no. Luna escaped. Luna escaped. I was trying my best, she got away. Made of uh, metal frames, bolted down, and worker. Nicely tacked, really lovely reindeer so there. Um, well made. You see, you see the, the, the muscles and stuff on them. And like, like, I can't say I see it in a real reindeer really close up. You do see them, they run. But I mind if I did see a real reindeer, it would look like that. Look, Luna's all into reindeers. Luna loves her art, you know. How do you think? The other dog was just pissed against the car wheels. You wouldn't see our Luna pissing against art like. Oh, she admires it. So there's the reindeers. There's another wee reindeer on his own the other side. He got lost. Oh, Luna. You come there in the morning, you think of the piss to yourself. See, even a bit of rain this morning. I cut up as raining. 
Oh, not that many out today. Ball it up! Now, this is handy here for families and elderly. A bit boring for lunas. It's too flat and gravelly. But this was like this before they done all the development. Uh, before they done these the A6 road up, you could always come in here. I never did come in here. Because I presumed that that time the Woodland Trust bought these pieces, all new trees. All them trees, they weren't very old, they're all new. Not interested. But the older trees over this side. But I never knew. And it was never in it. I never actually came out. I went down to the other woods, Brackfield Wood and them. But I didn't come into this one. It's actually a nice wee wood. Blackbirds are coming out. Keep an eye on blackbirds. But uh, got some good ones the last couple of weeks. Uh, they put a wee thing up. Uh, your dog has to stay in the footpath. Um, what is it about lead? If another dog is on its lead, you put your dog on a lead or something like that. Their dog was on a lead. What could I do? Oh, look. See, I can't be asked for that there now. Like, see. We're following the trails today. I'd rather go that way. No, no, Mom, we're following the arch. That's what I mean, like. Sorry, but arch down this way, Luna. People want to see the arch trail. If you're coming here yourself, go that way. That's the nice path. Along the river. But we're doing the arch today. This is taking us out to the other wee reindeer. So you must take the nice river. That's the thing about trails, you see. People are sitting in, in offices and places and drawing wee lines. See, there's not much to see here, is there? Like, it's basically a shortcut. But even with that shortcut, it's still four miles. If we went the long ways everywhere, oh, it'd be six miles. But today, this is hard. People say my videos are too long. I have to keep up a bit shorter. I like to show the whole path. So when people come here, they know exactly what they get themselves in for. I used to do reviews. There's all we do over there. Hey, you know what? I have never seen that deer there, boys. See, that's why you got out trails. I've never seen that one. Look at that. He's got his antlers in it. I've never seen that deer. I've always gone the scenic route. Hey, we're sticking with the art today, Pet. This is our trail. Oh, he's got his antlers there, boys. Hey, look at the size of him. Took some work on that there. He looks more mean, doesn't he? Like, oh, he does. He's, if he was in real life, I wouldn't be standing here. Devi wouldn't walk behind him, a kiki. What the wee tails and all like. Lovely job, I love them. And you want the wee deer for your garden, wouldn't you? What would you not pay for that in a garden centre? And say so the time will come and all the work will eventually go. And you're left with a metal frame. But see there a couple of years, yeah a year anyway. Last them well. What are you See, we maybe missed that better out there before, but if you come in the water time, these things stand out easier. Might be hard to see in the autumn with the colour of the leaves. But keep an eye for it, Luna. We don't know what all the art is around here. Luna, you have to stay in the footpath. The sign says stay in the footpath, no terrorising. Mom, that's what it says. The net is getting better. As long as there's no rabbits or squirrels. Ah, she's a good girl. I'm looking all over now for more out now. I didn't realise there was deer there. This is actually a very good day for walking. It's not as dusty hot. I don't think it's been passed much longer now, you know. First time I came in here, 
was from uh, Bentola Bridge and they didn't have a footpath made at that time it looked like they were going in Ecuador and I went through the trees along with Luna and I came to a wire fence and I climbed a pallet trying to get over the fence to get in but I went up and down a wee bit trying to look for places to come in and that was my first time in Hopewood I took them about a month before they actually put a path in and then I took them all six months before they actually put stones on them but, uh, there's the other deer over there now But in saying that, then, these are things aren't uh, labelled as such. Now maybe I see that on the way back. If you follow your wee signs, I see that on the way back. See what? So I won't bother going to that one now. We'll find the trail today. We'll just follow these wee signs as a button. There's a wee sign there now. That's the way back again. The wee blue one now, so it's going this way. That's the original old entrance there. That would have took you to a, a long layby. And the layby in the road was the part of the old main road. And when you parked your car on, you had a great distance to walk along the tarmac before you got from Oakwood to the other woods. So this is the new wood now, this is the newest one. Red Bray Wood Car Park. Red Bray Wood, they built um, Brackfield Wood. Uh, there's another wood out there, Killaloo Wood is next to Brackfield Wood, but that's not part of the trail. So Killa Killaloo Wood is still, um, more than that, it's still, as it always was, steep paths and stuff. I fixed that wee stream there about six, seven months ago. The water was coming up around here and I was me through all them stones over there I got all the stones and tied them up here trying to get the water to go back down again What are you doing my butt like? I know that it's gone down a bit you can show it with more stones but volunteers might come today and see me and then I say what the hell are you doing there like? but just trying to get these stones over a bit like I say you see and help them out like close to the water now they don't want the water going down too quick, so you get soil erosion. But the path to go down back is just coming the wrong way, like. He was turning all this away. Everybody, everybody can do their bit. So there's the new path here now. The nicest bit of that wood is in there. And they have fenced it off. I think that's deliberate. If you want to, that, they don't want to do it destroying the natural part. But when I first came here, this wasn't here like, and I was walking down along there. And that's, that's a nice wee bit of wood in there. Yeah, between the, the river and the wee stream. I'll say if you put a path in there, it would have spoiled it. You see like a wee bit of stream there like, finish water, whatever it is. See, that, that looked nice down there, doesn't it? Yeah. I make my way, like I say, this path wasn't here. I was trying to find my way in, and I went up and down along there. I think the wee pallet is over here somewhere that I climbed over to first come in here. There's a road above there now. they home bargains there, boys. There's bargains to be had. I'm going to restart the shells. If you're an engineer, it's a must to come down and see this big bridge from underneath. Some jobs with it. You see where they put the wire and all up? They do not want you going into the nice wee bit of the wood. 